one of my online Facebook groups was talking about catch vomit the other day. This is like a factor for life. Okay, well, this is a brand new carpet. This is my new carpet. And it is a smart strand mohawk carpet. And it's their new silk line, which makes means it's a little thicker and it's a little bit softer. It is supposed to be easy to clean up. Well, it has proven to be quite easy, actually. So we're going to do that. First of all, you don't want to rub anything in. We're just going to pick it up. Sometimes if you have a, a little spatula or something like that, um, that's also a possibility. But I'll often just... Just sort of pick it up like this. And then, 50% vinegar, 50% water. Wet it down good. You can also use a tool for this if you don't want to use your fingers. Just agitate, agitate. We're just gonna agitate it times in each direction. Agitate a couple times in each direction. Okay, here we go. Don't worry, I'll wash my hands later. White towel. a little more. Maybe give it another little spread. Sometimes these stains um, will rise to the top. It'll look like you got it all clean. You'll come back and it stains there again. So you just do it again. Okay. This carpet cleans up pretty good because it is a new carpet. My previous carpet was also Smart Strand and it cleaned up relatively well. But lifetime guarantee doesn't mean my lifetime, that's for sure. Some of the stains were beginning to... I was not very good about having it professionally cleaned. I got nervous about the prof what the professional cleaners would do to a smart strand carpet. I'm going to have to get over that and have this one cleaned once a year professionally, I think. Because I didn't do it with the last one. Okay, I can still see a little bit of shading there. We'll just keep after it. Clean side of the towel. Don't want to rub it too much. You can rub it a little bit. I know. I know. There's you. You out there with the hardwood floors. I like my carpet. Okay. This is actually looking pretty good. I don't see any stain at all. I might uh, have to touch it up a little bit later. We'll see. And uh, before you suggest cleaners, all of those magic cleaners, I refuse to put those in my carpets. I ruined two carpets trying them and ended up with big white bleach spots. I will use um, I will use Folex, which is um, which is a, a kind of a lightweight soap. But so far, I have not used any on this new carpet. All I've used is water and vinegar, and we're going to keep it that way if we can.